Welcome to our very first episode of Purple Jeffrey. We've got a great game show today. And Sammy Snake will be going out to meet the animals. And let's get on with our first game called Balloon Burst Challenge. Hi, Ellen Crimson, please. Hi there, this is Sam Nate reporting live from the Chicken Factory here at Wilberforce Sitcom College. Let's go and have a look at the chicken. First, I'm going to talk about the well-known animal, the chicken. A chicken is one of the most common domestic animals with a population of more than 24 billion, which was back in 2003. Whoa! Which means there could be a lot more chickens now. Chickens are omnivores and will eat seeds, herbs, grubs and insects. Chickens get fed treats like wheat, cracked corn, sunflower seeds, garden weeds and non-salty table scraps. Chickens can be trained to come to you by picking and calling a name given to them with a treat when they come to you. Wacky fact about the chicken. Believe it or not, chickens love to eat their own eggs. They will not eat an egg that is already cracked, but toss an egg onto the ground and watch them come running to eat it white and yolk. I am now going to move on to yet another domestic animal, which you might have heard about. They are very popular, the rabbit. Did you know that a female rabbit is called a doe, and the male rabbit is called a buck, and also a young rabbit is called a kit or a kitten? Rabbits usually live in group. However, when you have them as pets, people tend to get one unless they have large living environments. Wild European rabbits live underground in burrows. Rabbits can live to around 10 years, and their ears can be as long as 10 centimetres. They are born with no fur and their eyes closed. Some people may see wild rabbits as pests because they are herbivores, which means they eat plants. They may get people's crops and get people angry. Did you know that the chinchilla can jump up to five feet above their head? And also, a female chinchilla breeds twice a year. These chinchilla come in a variety of colours, including white, black, beige, standard grey, sapphire and violet. The predators of chinchillas include birds of prey, skunks, cats, large birds, snakes and dogs. Many people keep chinchillas as pets. One of the reasons for this is because they do not have fleas, which is good. Finally, we are going to look at a very interesting animal, which is, in fact, a reptile known as a bearded dragon. The name bearded dragon came from the fact that when these reptiles puff up, their spiny skin under their throat looks like a beard, which is very interesting. When they are poorly cared for, bearded dragons can live up to 10 to 12 years. Males can grow up to about 16 to 24 inches. However, females tend to be usually smaller. They make their skin a very light colour so that it deflects the heat. What makes a bearded dragon so fun to keep? They look really, really cool and are fun to watch. They're gentle and have laid-back personalities. They are a great introduction for anyone interested in reptile pet parenting and finally, they're fun to take care of. 
A schoolgirl from Pakistan who was shot in the head by a Taliban has now decided to make a campaign to start an education for Pakistani schoolgirls. She was shot while campaigning for education rights for girls. She says, I want every girl to be educated. After she was shot, she was sent to the hospital in Birmingham where she received major treatment to sustain her injuries. She has been recovering there since October. Canada is getting rid of its one cent coin and shopkeepers now have to round up or round down to get their final price. The Canadian government decided to stop their production as the cost was too much and the value was too little. Other countries like Australia, Brazil and Sweden don't have pennies either. There is excitement building over the new possible PS4, the PlayStation, and the creator Sony said it may be available next month. The electronics company have announced that they will host a meeting on the 20th of February. The company has not confirmed whether the new product will be launched at the meeting. The follow-up to the massively successful Temple Run has beaten gaming records to be the fastest selling mobile game of its time. Cow has been found on the new toy. Traffic chaos as it got stranded in the middle of the motorway. Traffic was delayed while the farmer tried to rescue the animal back to safety. Driver snapped the cow looking a bit lost on its way down the motorway at 8 a.m. on the 30th of January. The Middle Eastern country, Iran, has announced that they have successfully sent a monkey into space. The animal reached a height of 75 miles, and now you'd like to know that the monkey is still alive. A six-year-old diver has been causing a splash in the swimming pool. He has attracted major attention from top diver Tom Daly. Fearless Oscar dreams of Olympic success. He can jump for a 10 meter board, which is the same height as a two double decker buses. Since David Beckham announced he was leaving LA Galaxy in December, there's been rumors of where he'll be moving to next. Yesterday, big spenders Paris Saint Germain announced that they'd signed Golden Balls Beckham. Now for the weather. Rain is moving in swiftly from the south of the country. It will be moving up to Scotland and across to the east coast. The west coast will be mainly dry as well as Northern Ireland. Apparently, but there is freak storms coming in from the western of the US as well, heading into Ireland and Liverpool and Manchester. So stay indoors and keep dry. Red and the can of fair from the audience, please. Five, four, three, two, one. Right, that's it from Purple Jeffrey. Um, I hope you had a good time as much as we did. And last word from Josh, please. I am the winner. Not a winner. The winner. Common words from a common guy. Right then, join us next week.